Hey, what's up, everybody? Gonna go ahead and uh, open up. One. I have a hundred of these coins, the free coins for the bronze. I'm gonna go ahead and open uh, open them up. As you can see, I haven't bought any coins, and I don't plan on buying anything. There are a couple better deals out now. Right now, they have some a decent deal for these ones, but still, don't feel like it's worthy enough for me to buy it. Um, especially based on the luck I have a lot of times with the openings. Last one, I went a little carried away. I think I bought more coins than I probably wanted to. Well, definitely more than I wanted to, trying to go after the Freedom Fafnir, and I never got it. And now you don't even have the option for the Freedom Fafnir, so I'm already upgrading a regular one, so I don't really want to... Um, yeah, I'm not really motivated to, to put much money or even any right now into any of these. And not much that excites me. I, I did want this pilot, but now I'm just like, yeah, whatever. I already started upgrading Joanna. If I get it, I get it. <clears throat> I don't, I don't. It's two motherships. I can care less because in a month there'll be, a, there'll be better ones already coming out. Titan, I have this guy. I would never upgrade him. I don't have this limited one, but still pretty garbage in my opinion. I mean, it's a cool idea, but it's not a very good Titan, I think, overall. And it's a lot to upgrade him. Um, yeah, it'd be cool to get a Revenant, but it's already hard enough to upgrade as it is when you're not spending all kinds of money and spending a little bit here and there. And So I'm not too worried about it. i am already got plenty of stuff to upgrade. I got... Plenty of things to try to do, so all right, let's go ahead and open up this and see what it is. And it's gonna be crap. Yep. Hooray Hornet components. I have more than I ever would need, and I don't even would never use it, so there you go. That was exciting right there, wasn't it, everybody? Um, I don't know if somebody just tried to invite me. Oh, no, nobody. Okay. Um, oh, no, it was a different message. I'm going to give it a second, see if, um, Trippy's going to jump in and want to run duo or anybody else if he, um, oh, nice. My son's friend's watching my stream right now. Awesome. That's pretty cool. He just texted me, my son's friend from school. How you doing, Antoine? Thanks for watching. Um, yeah, um, we'll go ahead and Probably, I'll probably just run a solo right now. We'll see if uh, Trippy comes on, gets into play. Never know. We'll see. Um, I am going to, I am, so I do will tell everybody out there that watches, I am giving up and I have given up again. I, I've done this before on going for the gold black market chest. Um, not going to be going for this anymore. I think Pixonic needs to really revamp some of the stuff they put inside of this chest. There's a lot of things in here that are not worth it, should not be in here at all. And to be honest, I think the 10 million silver is kind of a joke. I know a lot of people think that's a good prize, but I really don't think it's a good prize. Um, a lot of people would disagree with me, but what I'm going to do is save up some keys. I don't know how many yet, but what I'm going to open up is the bronze chest, and I want to kind of show everybody... Let's see what we can get out of this bronze chest and then think about the amount of keys spent to get what I get here versus the amount of keys spent to get what you usually get out of here. And nine out of ten times you get a prize out of here that you're never going to use or you never want. And if you get a weapon or if you get a bot, you're only going to be able to sell the weapon for like three million or whatever, three point something million silver. 
and a bot you're going to sell for maybe up to 5 million silver, which isn't very good for a thousand keys. It's a lot of keys to grind. And even if people who are out there buying keys, you're spending a lot of money chasing crap, kind of, you know, really nothing good. The best prize, which I got last time, it took me almost a year before I got to see it again, is 5,000 gold. And it's a great prize, I think, but it's not... I think it's easier for you to get that much gold on this one and you get more silver on this one. In reality, I think that's what most of us need the black market for. It's for gold and silver. Most of the stuff in here is almost worthless unless you're a newer player and you don't have robots or weapons in your hangar and you're trying to establish getting some weapons or some bots that you want. Um, you know, that that's when you would want to go for this chest, but... If you already have the bots that you want or, or bots that you want that would be in here or weapons out of here, it's really not much point. For me, there's only two things that I would probably want in this chest, and that'd be to get another crate, which I've never seen pop up in here, um, or 5,000 gold. It's the only two things I see a value in this chest. Everything else is like, duplicates of things that are almost pointless so my opinion though I mean that's the way I see it it's the way I approach it but yeah let me go ahead and drop in enough chatting I'll do plenty of chatting during the stream as it goes so let's go ahead and roll one let's jump into some beacon rush oh they got skirmish rolling you know what after I get off the stream I probably will run some skirmish actually no let's go ahead and run a skirmish right now check it out i heard it might be fafnir's i'll go ahead and run one on the stream um check it out but the, the silver this is a good way to grind silver because you can get some quick matches and use your ads or grind upgrades yeah it is fafnir's i think it's only your built-in ability is that all you got all right here we go this might not be a oh no We'll see how it goes. So it looks like it's probably only your ability. You're going to be able to run 350 meters and attack. What it's looking like. Yep, built in ability. Oh, and you got phase shift. Looks like is your module. This is kind of funny. Sometimes they do these funny skirmishes. But it looks like it'd be a long match. You know, only try to attack with your built-in ability, but we'll see. All right, there we go. One Faffy down. Faffy number two. So it looks like everybody's just kind of chilling out on this side. Um, a snowflake over there looks like he's doing the right thing, trying to hit their home beacon. I'm going to go with them and support. See if we can divert some of those strawberries over there. And um, looks like snowflake's already on the beacon. Cool, I'm going to go support. Let's get this beacon, and then I want to run to dam over there. No one's even took dam, which I find pretty funny. All right, cool. We got we got a little action over here. This guy's got death mark. Let's go ahead and hit this guy with some death mark. He's got two attacking me though, but let's go ahead and work on him. All right, I died, but he's almost out. Uh, <laughs> this guy's got jump module. That's pretty funny. All right, I'm gonna do a little one of these guys. Let me get up here. We got a four cap though. I think the, the blueberries are starting to realize that the strategy is not working so hot. So I use the jump module to put myself a little bit higher in the air, get a more aerial attack on some of these guys from above. So I would manually lock on. But these guys' strategy, I mean, I get what they're trying to do. They're trying to use strength in numbers, putting three bots on one bot, two bots on one bot. And it's kind of smart. 
but it's also not in this in Beacon Rush or TDM. Sorry, I think this is um, Shield Breaker. I don't really see much use against a bunch of Fafnirs um, unless they're just jumping up with their absorber, but. We'll check it out. Looks like the red team's down a player already. They probably quit or something, most likely, or who knows, maybe they tanked out. But I will go ahead and I'm going to put my target on the guy in center. There we go. He's out. Target the next guy in center. See if we can get center back. I don't know if the shield breaker is going to do anything to this guy, but all right, they got me, and I will drop my last spot. So if my, once my last spot goes, I'm just going to go ahead and X out of the game, and I'm going to run into uh, Beacon. I'll play Beacon Rush. But I just want to check it out, run one. This is the guy with the phase shift. I guess they run you with uh, all the different modules. I'll go ahead and phase. Lock on this guy. out Let's lock onto this guy about to die but it's all right I'm trying to he's trying to shield his buddy over there we'll take this beacon and then I'll be a four cap who knows maybe we might went on beacons before I bought out I doubt it but never know All right, here we go, phasing, before I die. And there we go, botted, but it looks like we're going to win the game right when I bought, so that worked out perfect. Not bad, we got a quick victory. Um, big money, guys, watch out for the silver. As you see, you don't get uh, much out of that, but... Even especially getting a win in second place, it's kind of funny, but uh, it's all right. It was, it's fun to just check it out. Definitely fun to check it out. But all good. Let me go ahead and I will jump jump right into a beacon rush. Actually, you know what? I've been telling everybody I want to stream a free-for-all. Let's go ahead and throw a free-for-all in there. I haven't played free-for-all in probably three months, two, three months. I don't know. Let's go ahead and drop one free-for-all, too. Mixing it up. All right, let's see. Um, I'll probably... My Fafnir is not very strong, level 10, not very strong weapons, but I'm thinking that I will... Oh, man, somebody already left the match. I'm going to drop... I'll drop Fafnir. Let's figure out... Oh, against the Rochi. Tough matchup already. Rochi be the Fafnir killer, so... See, my level 10 can hold up. I don't know what he's doing though interesting way to play look at that last stand oh my goodness now that to me guys is pointless but some like running that big fat last stand maybe that look is is what they like but all right rochi down we did all right he last standed us i kind of screwed up i actually hit my modules when i was last standed so no big deal at least we got the kill Let's see what we can do. Now 
now I could have really used my healing. I'm locked down in the air, getting jacked. Oof, though, they stole that kill. It would have been nice to get a second kill before I died, but... You know, let's go ahead and heal up with him. See if we can... See if we can get another kill here with Faf, even though... Oh, actually, I didn't even think about him. My weapons are destroyed. Oh, well. They just let him die. Oh, it's like an Ares over there. And it is. Get him to shoot my shield. There we go. Lovely Ares. Shoot my shield. Shoot my shield. See if we can kill you with one weapon. We got you. Alright, cool. That was worth it. Fall down. Die. Alright, he got me. Alright, now let's bring out my Rochi. I like this spot. Lots of fun. There's something close by. Where'd he go? Alright, let's see if we can finish this guy off. He's tough. He's tough, though. All right, we got him. I gotta watch out, though. I got, I got guys everywhere. So, FFA. Sometimes it's you don't want to get too far out there and put yourself in a pickle. I'm kind of assessing the area. Um, not too bad right now. Alright, he got him. I was hoping I could finish him off. Let's see if we can go finish the first place guy. So he's, he's playing the troll game. You can tell he uh, plays the FFA a lot and likes to do his little corner shoot, dance, lurk around and attack who he can, which is a good strategy for FFA, but I'm going to go after him make him put another Fafnir in here in a second. Alright, he's out. Go ahead and orbital strike him. He's out. Oh, I missed with the orbital strike. Oh, excellent hit. Oh, I think I hit power cells instead of orbital strike. Ah, could have got him too if I was quicker. I was too busy hitting the wrong button on the keyboard. But now I'm far from the action. We got an Arthur over here. Could go after that Arthur, but I see a lot of I see a lot of action going over here. That Arthur wants a piece. I don't blame him. There we go. We got a rampage. Ooh, it would have been nice to steal that and get a godlike too. All right. This guy's still holding first strong. Got his Faffy up. Titans are all targeting me, for, but it's all right. And he's going after that one, so now that Titan's going to target him, hopefully. All right, perfect. Wow, he dropped that Arthur like nothing, though. I think it's too late to get a godlike, but I should hopefully be able to finish this guy off. He's trying to play the troll game again. He wants that guy to kill him. He doesn't want me to kill him, I'm sure. Alright. No godlike, but at least we got him. Oof, got rocked by them gendarms. Um, let's go ahead and bring our Titan out. A little Minos in the in the mix. So we got a Gendarm boy up there. Perfect. I'm shooting to my reflector, please. Kind sir. Where are you going, dude? Where are you going, you skinny, long-legged, weird-looking bird? back and play. Uh oh, you know I got a reflector again on, right? There we go. Little orbital shark for the guy in first place who's been trolling around. Let's tease him a little bit. 
let's make him feel like we're really afraid of him. Which he is tough. Probably stronger hanger than I have. But let's go ahead and have a little fun. You should take me out though. Yeah, he's gonna get me, but it's alright. Should have backed off a little earlier, let the hawk get me. Alright, let's run Shell. See if I can catch up to that Arthur before he dies and kill him with Shell. I don't know if I'll get there quick enough. You notice I always get spawned on the opposite side for some reason in FFA. I, it happens a lot. They always push me away from the action. Um, that hawk's probably going to get him, though. Yeah. Oh, well. Too bad. So Hawks running Vipers. Um, he's gonna run away until he gets his ability on. I get it. I got a Faffy trying to come chase me down. Not too worried about him. Like he's gonna. You notice this guy's mainly just running Faffy. Let's uh. Let's show him that. A shell even with flames and rockets can still kind of hold his own a little bit. He might kill me, but I ain't going to make it as, that easy for him. He's going to... Wasted my... Oh, they're both targeting me. And you guys on the same team or what? What are you doing over there? Let's go get Demeter out. Ooh, where did that? Oh, the orbital sharded me. And obviously, you see, I'm not really afraid to go after him. But he's definitely a lot more afraid to engage. Oh, he got the kill. Oh, man. This guy in third place is making a comeback because he's just snaking the kills. I know the first place guy can't be botted out. Yeah, he's playing. This guy's playing the troll game too. He's playing the kill stealer with the uh, long range ox setup, which is fine. Oh well, it's over. At least we got second place, eight kills, not too bad. I'm, like I said, I haven't played free for in a long time. Um, good to get out there, have a fun little battle, see what was going on. Not much damage. Um, I wasn't expecting it the way they were playing. Looks like I had the toxic guy out there, toxic slayer. Good, good game to him. He played well. Um, used the Fafnirs. Was trolling, uh, trolling around. Um, he's only a Master League one, though, huh? Toxic City. He's got a pretty strong hanger, other than this Orochi. Orochi's only level seven, but he's running pretty good. Pretty good stuff. <sighs> Not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, he did good. 
Good job, Toxic Slayer. This guy was doing pretty good too. See, he was making a comeback. He tied me on kills. I just got him on damage and I got him on this point. So, uh, it was a good fight. Good fun. The other guys, not so much, but. All right, now I can go ahead. I'll, I'll roll into a beacon rush here in a second. Let me go ahead and collect uh, some of this stuff real quick. Got some of the great ships. Got some platinum, which is always good. A little bit of gold. There's only one chip out of here that's probably worth anything, and that would be the repair fix to combine. But other than that, those chips are worthless. But what do you expect for them giving them to you for free in a preview? You know, they're not going to give you quality chips. I don't see that happening. All right, let's go ahead and let's get into a beacon rush. Shoot, only other thing I want playing is TDM. I only play TDM when the when a squad and the squad picks it and squad leader picks it, and I end up in it. It's rare. You'll. It's not likely you'll see me say, "Hey, let's drop a TDM, guys." That's just not. Not how I roll. Beacon Rush and FFA, my game modes. Mainly Beacon Rush these days. Used to be FFA. All right, let's get uh, Demeter out there. We're going to go ahead and head towards the parking lot right now. Rochi. Rochi on attack. Looks like he's got Redeemers. Pretty strong, quick hitting weapon. This will be a fun one. You know what I should have put on? I didn't even think about it. Was some silver boosters? I need silver bad right now. Burn it up. Kind of upgrade is no joke. It's all good. All right, we got that guy's running away. He's like, I don't know why he wants to face towards home, but I don't think it's gonna help him. There's two bots hanging out at home, so we'll we'll shift away. Now he's trying to hit me from behind. All right, he wants to target. But he he's got a little thing against my Demeter, so let's. Square back up with him. He made a mistake. If he really wanted that beacon, he shouldn't have shot at me. He should have let me go after that other guy and kind of creeped his way up to the uh, beacon. That would have given him a better opportunity of capping it. But now he's got another Demeter coming, so I mean another Rochi coming. But not too worried about it. Let's go ahead and drop back shell on the same beacon. And now let's have some Rochi explosion action. He's out. Shell's the perfect bot to drop against him. Taking parking lot back. We got a four cap. Now we can see if we can box him in, maybe. Take him, take him to their home. Here we go, Fenrir. Little baby orbital shark. Gonna tickle you. With a baby attack. Now, uh, should be able to take this guy out. This exile in. Got a little tier buddy here helping him out. Not for long. He's down. I like attacking a bot right when it drops in. That's pretty fun. It's a Falcon, so it's strong. T Falcon. It's fun to just start hitting them right when they drop it. Oh. Alright, he's going to get me, which is fine. I don't want to get my Titan out. Alright. 
All right, parking lot. Here we go. You're dead. Orbital shard. This guy. They got house, but it doesn't really matter. We're taking their home too. So I was gonna go after house, but no real point. So let's go ahead and I'm at him. The match is gonna end less than a minute anyway. They're gonna have to make a serious adjustment if they wanted to come back from this one right now. He's out. Got another orbital shark for this guy. He's out. Let's go ahead and uh, keep going. He's out. All right, home beacon is secured again. Who do I want to go after? Yeah, how they want to hide? They all want to hide. I don't blame them. Go after this Ming Lee up here. All right, they dropped the squad over here, which is fun. Orbital shard. A lot of ammo. We got him too, so that's a godlike. Is this going to be a beyond godlike? Oh, we couldn't kill him. Not bad. Could have got another one there, just a little slow. Good W. We got the top spot, seven kills, three beacons at least. Got the W, so which is good. Um, looks like I didn't have too much for randoms on my team, but also looks like there wasn't too much competition on the other side either. I think that's because I haven't played much. The season just started, and I think I've only played, I've probably played maybe 10 games max, 15 games max since the season, the season started. Just been working a lot the last few days, and uh, it'll show you if I go and show you my cups real quick, wherever I am way down the list yeah I only got 134 cups right now so um you can see I haven't played too much um, but yeah it's all good let me go ahead and collect what I got here peace a good prize good prize I already got like three three demeters four demeters so it, it is normal that's is a good thing to get Demeter components, because usually they give us components for something worthless, so. And everyone that knows me, they know I like my Demeter. I had two of them in for a little bit. I kind of wasted a, um, like I wasted a lot of silver and gold grinding, upgrading that second Demeter and getting the pilot to 70, when I probably should have just left my MK2 Hawk back in. Um... But whatever, it is what it is. Um, trying to help out in squad, but for Demeter, I feel like you really got to take Demeter all the way. And mine still has some stuff that could be upgraded, but this is probably my closest spot to being fully pumped. And uh, and then Shell and Fenrir. Once I get the weapons, if I ever get these weapons done, if I don't go to something else... Um, then I'll be pretty close. You see my Demeter. You can tell I, I, I put in a little bit of gold today to get his skills finally maxed out. Um, that's pretty cool. Yeah, this is definitely my most advanced robot in my hangar, I would say. Shell and Fenrir being the close, close competition. All right, let's go ahead and roll another one. My silver is still looking pretty bad, but at least I'm racking up some videos so I can try to use some ads for supply drops and things and keep building it up. My platinum's growing, which is good. Been saving it for a while now. Um, I want to upgrade that crate, but uh, waiting for the big discount if it ever comes again. But it's also a good thing because if I get those anti um, control modules. I don't even know if I'll go for upgrading a crate right away. I think I'll go for an anti-control module when the good discount comes. But if that good discount doesn't come, I might just have to give in and wait and do it on a 10%, which I'd rather not do. But 
We'll see. One day at a time. You never know what's going to happen. Let's run... Uh, run a beacon rush. Dog's barking at some over there. It's fine. Oh, Demeter. All right, Rascal, calm down. All right, here we go. Jumping Phantom head in the house. So we got three red guys on the house. So that gives us an opportunity to take advantage of other beacons. So let's see if I can slow these guys down. That's my objective. Slow them down and see if I can slip in and take house. Let's drop this phantom. Should be able to, I would hope. There we go. Ran out of ammo right before I, right when I killed him. All right, so he's going to try to roll me a little bit, which is fun. He's next on the radar. Yeah, come at me. Go in my shield. It's okay. Where you going, Blitzy? You can dance all you want. I will still get you. Jump. Do whatever you gotta do. Call your buddies. You're gonna need them. Go ahead and attack this shell. Another shell out here now. Got a fun fight here on the house. He's out. I don't know what our blueberries are doing though, but no, nope, everyone's spawning over here for some reason. They all follow me over here. And now we're just allowing all the other beacons to be held by the red team. So that's not a good thing. Um, I need, I want to get away since nobody else is, but... I think I should just press these guys until the bot's dead. And then I'll drop a bot somewhere else, because... That didn't work out well with having all the whole blueberry team just coming over here. Abandoning everything. I'm just gonna go ahead and drop my Titan now. I really can't trust how this game's gonna unfold with the teammates I got. I'm gonna go after parking lot, get this beacon. See if any of them drop here. Nope. None of them dropped. Get a little orbital shard for the trap king over there. Oh, I must have, oh, there we go. Oh, I missed. But. Perfect. AJ landing, but he phased. He phased again. Boy, 80 power cells for nothing. Just to prolong your death, AJ. Well, that was worth it. I don't think it was. Oh, we're having a dog barking competition in the background. Sorry about that. Friday night dog fest. Yeah, they're all singing now. I guess dogs want to party too. Oh, good. Orbital shark. All right, let's get him out. I'm kind of keeping these guys distracted until I die. At least I got their home, and now we got a four cap, so this really helped. I see a big banana right there. Sweet. Let's go attack still with shell. Keep the pressure on them. Pedal to the metal. Attack all these guys as much as we can. They got all their titans. This is super fun now. I got all their titans out. We're at their home spawn, about to have a five cap. We were losing this, but 
all of a sudden see how it flipped by spreading them out. Put a roach in. Still got some little game lags, but it's alright. Right now it's not too bad. I'll, I'll really find out when I'm squatting more. Oh, better watch out for Scotty Too Hotty over there, huh? He uh, thinks he's a WWE wrestler from back in the day. Alright, this game's gonna end. I won't even, I wanted to get the Fafnir out, but I won't get it. It's already over. Nice win, nice uh, comeback. As you guys saw the start, they had us on beacons because everybody tried to follow me on the house. Um, not well coordinated, but I think uh, blueberries started to realize that, or I spread it out a little bit, and um, everybody settled in and did good. This guy's a good player. Dark Elite, strong player. He did really well. 11 kills, 4 million. Nice job. Um, Dark Elite guys are solid. Good players. Really good players. This guy did good too, so it was nice. He got a lot of kills and beacons. And, yeah, it's fun. Yeah, it was fun, so... Good match. Let's go ahead. And we'll roll another beacon. I'm going to check to see if anyone was going to come on or join. Um. Let's get a message trip. To find out when he's going to come on time. Well, I guess I'll probably end up if, taking a break unless he comes on soon. Um, in a little bit and get something to eat. Or I jump in for some more grinds, clear some videos. But I'll play another one right now. Um, I'll probably roll another beacon rush. Seeing if I need to reflect on any of these. Uh, I don't know. Hold on one second, though. Check something. Sorry, my kid still doesn't want to listen in an uphill battle, but it's all right. All right, let's uh, drop in another beacon. Shell looks like a Rubbermaid trash can that got broken down a little. I mean, not Shell, Revenant. Looked like one of them Rubbermaid trash cans that got sides busted out of it with legs. Like a Halloween costume gone bad. All right, here we go. Uh, we do something different. Let's put in Super Weak Fafnir first. So slow on the ground. Thing moves like a turtle. Oh, I think I was. I got a message popping in by one of the guys. Nice. The guy's rocking my favorite Christmas edition shell skin. Sweet. Look how weak my Fafnir is, though. He's already last standing. Extra weak with cheese. It's 
So far, I'm not too impressed with Fafnir. Um, but mine is pretty weak. I know it's going to get better, so that's why I'm not sweating it. Rochi all day for me over Fafnir right now. Even at the lower levels, Rochi all day. down, we got another one on us, plus a phantom. Oh, he fades, I was about to whack him with one more glory shot. He is lucky he fades. All right, let's go Demeter. Should have probably dropped Shell, but I wanted to get over. Oh, and of course, I thought I was latched the other guy first, but it latches me to the Demeter right next to me on the beacon in front of me. That was funny. Very funny. Let's get my ability back on. Wouldn't have gone through all that damage if I uh, didn't miss that. Teleport. It's okay. I'm not worried. Um, I probably should have used repair unit. Should use my modules, but I didn't. I don't usually, like I said, I don't usually use modules. Um, solo, I have been using it every once in a while when I'm streaming. Definitely had some uh, players tell me I should be using them more and they really want me to boost too which uh, when I come back on I'm definitely I gotta try to remember to throw some silver boosters on some key boosters I'll probably throw an attack booster on usually I don't run them solo but if if I don't end up playing with somebody I do want to at least get some boosters on to try to grind some silver <laughs> oh I think I sh all right, I gotta check my message after this match if I don't forget, because I might have gotta jump in a couple squad matches before I take a break. Somebody wants to play. Orbital Shard, Weak Sauce. Good setup there for the guy from Jaeger Nation 2K Warrior with the Scourge Calamity. Strong setup on Fenrir. Nice. The guy from China is Demeter is here supporting me. That's cool. Don't know if I'll get him. I'll probably die before, but I got multiple people attacking me, but it's fine. We're making a comeback on this match, though. I don't know if we're going to be able to do it, though, but. Get my Titan out. Very important beacon to grab is this one up here. That if you see all the red team's doing a good job trying to protect. Fafnir's got Saddam and Roadhog on, I could tell. I was a little late on my reflector. I hit the wrong button, but it's okay. Go ahead and hit that Rochi away. Ooh, they did a good job attacking me. All right, let's drop my Fenrir home. The Fen home. A little Scourge on Scourge with some flame, though. Got the spicy Scourge edition Fenrir against his. Nice guy in China with his Demeter. He's still out here rolling with it. He's doing a great job. I wouldn't be surprised if he's uh, 
top player on our team. Strong. Panic Clan's really good. He's over here lighting people up. landing. I don't know if I can get to him. He fades. Hitting him a little bit. He's last standed. Alright, he got him. We got three. We need to get four. And we need to get four and hold four. Now let him get, uh, get him back to be able to win this. We do. It's a good comeback, though. So you see they're protecting that beacon at all costs, and that's smart because uh, there's a very important beacon in this game. You see they've, they've dropped so many players on this beacon, um, which I think can help us, though, because if we can control the other ones and get one more and hold, we can win. You see what the beacon bar is kind of turning on them. It's dropping on them. It's not going up for us, but it is going down for them. This is my last spot, though. I do have to be careful. There's still a couple minutes left, and I'm almost last standing. They're definitely looking for a way to target me and get to our home. This hawk's coming at me right now. I'm going to heal up now, even though I probably should have waited. But I want to keep my bot in the game a little bit. Got him. And we get this beacon and survive. So now this Fafnir, you see him going for a home. Alright, they're gonna they're gonna get us so we oh we're finally getting a fourth beacon, but it might be one of those two a little too late, though. You see the beacon bar? I think they got us, so it's already over. We got four, though. I don't know. They shouldn't... I don't know. They shouldn't let it end like that if that's the case. Because we can even get the fifth one right now. Can he hit the fifth? Or that's the fourth now, because they got one back. Damn. What a battle, though. If we win this, that's a good, good comeback. I know it's just... Solo random playing for us uh, or for me, but um, still nice to be able to get a comeback like this. Red team's probably like, oh, we lost barely. Wow, dang, we ended up losing that after all that. That red team's probably like, dang, these guys, they uh, put up a fight. Yeah, I didn't even get one beacon. That's pretty crazy. Bad game for me, but I knew the China guy was going to get top. Number two is a guy from He. He did really good, too. These guys, uh, this guy, yeah, 2K Warrior, good game. Guy from Mad, good game. This guy did good, too. They had a pretty, pretty well-balanced group, I would say, uh, on their top four or five. Not so bad. That was fun, though. Let me go ahead and check my messages real quick. Um, see what I got out there. All right, cool. Sounds like Trippy was just taking a break after playing some, um, playing for a long run, and then he'll uh, he'll get back on in a little bit and play it. So probably a good time for me to take a break, clear videos, get some something to eat, and yeah, I'll come back on that way we can get a stream rolling, get some duos going with Trip. So, um.
Yep, looking forward to the fun battles. All right, let me go ahead and drop out in this one. Thank you, thank you, everybody out there. Antoine, if you're still watching, thank you. Appreciate it. Um, take care. I'll see everybody soon.